As we get closer to Election Day, the road to the White House has a path through Michigan. The battleground state has seen campaign stops for both President Donald Trump and Vice President Joe Biden. Peter Curry joins us in the studio after covering today's event in Calumet. It's less than two weeks to go and Donald Trump Jr. stop at the Houghton County Memorial Airport was the first presence in the UP of a major player for either campaign. I was there around noon as the first guest showed up. By the time the gates opened around 3 p.m., dozens of people made their way in. And by the time the campaign event started, hundreds of people were gathered in and around the hangar. Some, but not all, people were wearing masks and social distancing was not widely observed. Look at those guys out there on the tractor trailer. That's awesome. Thank you guys. This is pretty, that's a pretty solid overflow crowd. That's like 7,500 Joe Biden rallies right there. And that's the overflow. Huh? But yeah, exactly. That's true. That was a quick one, right? I say the Upper Peninsula is neglected. We must give them some love. Donald Trump Jr.'s visit to the Keweenaw Peninsula wasn't the only stop in Michigan for the Trump campaign. Vice President Mike Pence held an event earlier in the day near Pontiac. To see Donald Trump Jr.'s full speech from today, we have it shared for you on upmarriage.com. Reporting in studio, I'm Peter Curry, Local 3 News.